What's up? Got a bunch of packages in. Time to get caught up. Been a while. So, I'm going to flip the camera around here. Go to work. Okay. You know how your parents always told you never to put your feet on the couch? Huh. Well, it's not on the couch, it's on the blanket. And guess what? It's my house and it's my couch and I can put my feet wherever I want. All right, first up, I received a package with these cards in it. StarQuest, Matt Ryan, Kurt Warner, number to 99. This is from Landshark. Oh, cra crap, now I've, uh, 571, I think. I'll put the link down below. I really like this card. Uh, Tris Speaker, manufactured patch, and a dual jersey of Jarius Norwood. Thank you very much for sending me those. You did not need to. Uh, my package truly was a just because. Next, I'm going to make an offer for um, anyone who can help me find a couple of particular people. I'm going to put the names, flash them on the screen here, right in front of my face. NYBash31. That's the name on Photo Bucket. That person has a card I definitely want to get my hands on for my uh, Ultimate Collection set. Actually, all four of these names. The other name is Zoe Renee 1106 I'll put that on the screen here. Uh, next name, which was a YouTuber, but it says the account is closed. If anyone knows this person, Derek2011. Derek2011. Would love to get a hold of these people. They all have cards that I need for my set, and some of them are nasty. And the last one is Dat Boy Taz, D A T B O Y Taz. If you know any of those people, and again, I'm putting their names on the screen so you can see them on Sports Card Forum or eBay or YouTube or anywhere else, if you recognize those names, please let me know how to get a hold of them. If I can get a hold of them and make a deal on these cards that I want, you will receive a finder's fee. All right, back to it. And I'll make it worth your while because they are absolutely sick cards. Next is for my set an awesome part of the nameplate Maglio Ordonez 2003. Moving along. Shipped in an envelope. No protection other than this flimsy ass card saver. $5 shipping, and it was $0.88 cents to ship it, but the card is fine. It's a beautiful autograph of Anthony Munoz. Not quite as nice as the Curtis Martin my brother showed the other day, but that is a really nice autograph, and he is the Bengals' only Hall of Famer, so he goes into my Hall of Fame PC. Uh, today, in a package that says Ibex on it, if you want to watch a very oh. funny video, Type in on YouTube, man arguing with Ibex. And you might just shit your pants laughing, it's hilarious. But anyways, Chris, uh, Sick for 2024, sent me this Lem Barney On Card Auto from SP Authentic for my Hall of Fame PC. Thank you very much, Emmett, I mean Chris. Also, came in yesterday, a really nice two-color, one-color, two-color. Tom Fears of Icons, and that came from Wenzel. And the number on that is 7 of 10. So Everett, thank you very much for that card. That's a really nice card. Uh, and I think I said Tom Fears, my bad. It's Ron Mix. Ron Mix, not Tom Fears. Clearly. Then I got this card in myself. I really like the 2001 Titanium dual-sided cards. It's a dual-sided Tony Gonzalez on one side. Shannon Sharp, uh, barely a two color if you can see down there, it's gold and white with stitching. Both Hall of Fame tight ends, love that card. That's going to be Hall of Fame PC. Next up, I'm going to take this out of the magnetic and take the top off. This is a beautiful card. Uh, upside down, but anyways, it's NFL. So if, uh, 
in the end there we've got Dick Night Train Lane actual patch and then we've got it is patch you can see the stitching there the pubes sticking out of the bottom of the F that is uh, Jim Parker X Colt and there's the aforementioned Tom Fierce two color patch that card I was on the phone at the time talking to Scoff 2244 5 of 25 and I won that card for what I thought was a fantastic price okay here's another one that I just won recently from this year's National Treasures a really nice three color of Alan Page the Vikings he's a nice Hall of Fame entry and I'm looking for the, there it is, 17 of 49. And a trade with 90's Cowboys Steve, I sent him something that he's going to pass along to someone else and the bonus Cowboys cards, the Felix Jones Auto and the patch and he sent me this beautiful card. Very hard to find patch of 49ers let alone three color patch. I'm not sure that must be part of the eight and there's the autograph Steve Young and even better yet number 25 so thank you for that Steve I appreciate that a lot really excited to get this next card in I have all three gold versions that include Joe DiMaggio Ted Williams and Mickey Mantle each in uh, different pairings of two I have the Ted Williams Mickey Mantle. Now I have the Joe DiMaggio Mickey Mantle jersey and jersey with pinstripe and the only one I'm missing to complete the small subset is the Joe DiMaggio Ted Williams. This card books for three hundred dollars and I won it the other night for eighty seven bucks. I'm extremely happy about having that card and I'm only one card away from completing that little mini set. This card I have to show just because I think it's so awesome. I may or may not keep this. I haven't decided yet, but I love oops, I love the card. Sorry, I gotta take it out here. This is the National Treasures uh, notable numbers. 448 it's a John Taylor and look at that patch that is part of the laundry tag patch John Taylor does not have a lot of stuff out there I loved him on the other side of the field from Jerry Rice and better yet it is number two of eleven I absolutely love that card may or may not hang on to it there's someone else in mind uh, that I may send that card to Speaking of which, doing something nice, there's do something nice, GC is me 2007. Once again, he sent me another package of stuff. Let's try and take that out of here delicately as I rumble the camera. Sorry. He sent me a snap case full of things. Very nice of you, Greg. Again, I can't tell you how much I appreciate your thoughtfulness and generosity in sending these to me. And here we go. First is a uh, Steve Largen on triple threads. Very nice, numbered to uh, 18. We've got a Leroy Selman on card auto, and I love that. Absolutely love that card because Le Leroy Selman's the only Hall of Famer for the Buccaneers. And I love Leroy Selman. I'd like to get my hands on a patch auto of his at some point in time. Here's a Willie Brown helmet card auto, numbered uh, 350 for the Raiders. This is an awesome card. It's a two color patch of the snake, Ken Stabler. Look at the number on that, 9 of 10. Way too much, Greg, way too much. I'm going to hit you back whether you like it or not. Uh, just out of appreciation, uh, Mike Ditka, flag patch, because I really, really do thank you for sending all these to me this one is awesome Jack Ham team trademarks jersey autograph 
number 20 of 25 killer card and a nasty two color prime jersey with the paint worn off Jerry Rice number 10 of 25 so those are some amazing cards Greg thanks again for sending those to me I know you said that they were just sitting around and you didn't have any particular use for them but nonetheless that is uh, a good deal of valuable cards there they will all go into my PC nowhere else I'm working on a little something else for you here too but finally MJF254 with the autograph on the package that's something new uh, the name is Matt Fetterman and it's somebody who I've not had any dealings with there's a package in here with a magnetic I have not looked at it here is something for your Falcons PC your videos are epic and you are a great asset heavy emphasis on the ass part of that word to the YouTube community keep up the great parodies smiley face a sick autograph and MJF 254 I'll put the link below try and open this one-handed pretty good at doing things one-handed see what we got here okay from the back it's a Michael Turner card number 15 out of 15 very nice Michael Turner jersey autograph out of uh, the NFL Nation subset of gridiron gear inscribed with a 33 and I don't see a lot of his stuff inscribed that is a really filthy card thank you so much for that Matt I appreciate that man that caps off a long video with a lot of stuff I appreciate you watching once again been a busy week here and uh, that's probably gonna be it for a few days cuz I'm all caught up now so I appreciate you watching hope everyone's doing well and I hope everyone is taking time to say good things to other people or do good other things for other people. Do good, people. Do good. See you later.